former House Speaker Newt Gingrich has defeated Mitt Romney to win South Carolina's Republican primary. Here's something you're going to hear Gingrich saying a lot over the next couple of days. Since 1980, the winner of South Carolina's GOP primary has gone on to win the party's nomination. Now, any way you slice it, this is a big victory for Gingrich. His campaign had said openly that Gingrich needed to win in South Carolina if he wanted a shot at the Republican nomination. He really seemed to pick up ground over the past couple of days, due in part to his strong performances in the recent debates. Also, he was helped by some slip-ups by Mitt Romney, who really couldn't seem to get a firm answer on whether or not he was going to release his tax returns. Now, Gingrich also faced some obstacles in South Carolina, particularly when his ex-wife did a television interview saying that Gingrich had once asked her for an open marriage. But that revelation really never seemed to take hold among South Carolina's social conservative voters. And that means we're on to Florida, a complex, expensive, and often unwieldy political state. One important thing to know about Florida is that thousands of absentee ballots have already been counted there before this shift in momentum. Now, on the surface, that does seem to benefit Romney, but this is a Republican field full of twists and turns. So all we really know at this point is that this race goes on to Florida likely after that. I'm Julie Pace for the Associated Press in Washington.